Hi Libra, welcome to Healing Guys Tarot. This is for your Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. And this is going to be from your guides, your angels, your ancestors, your loved ones that have passed over. This is going to be a message that they, they want you to hear at the time you happen to come across this video. And then that's when you meant to hear it. And please let me know if you like these um, readings. And I'll continue with these angel guides and loved ones meetings. So let's begin, Libra. What is the message for you from your guides, your loved ones, your angels here? Starting off with Mermaid in Koi Pond. Rediscover your individual. Yeah, yeah. Rediscover your individuality. Become the dragon. Okay, let's see what the message is. Number 41. Okay. About the mermaid of immersion. Mermaids do not live only on the surface. They live in beneath, underneath what you are see what you see taking place. You have been a surface dweller to I cannot speak. Someone must, must need to speak to you too. <clears throat> you have been a surface dweller too long and you are being asked to immerse yourself in the strange world beneath the waves. Here you will discover great treasures. See the mermaid's necklace brimming with wisdom which will be yours too and the delicate strong bright clownfish swimming around her. Who are they able? Who are able now to clear you of toxins to assist you in to see your true beauty and transmute the poisonous limitations you have set on yourself on your very reality you will no longer need to concern yourself with so much protection as the change you are making will make you virtually invisible to troubles and harmful others who are one who once would disturb you this immersion is the road to real rebirth. All will change and you will finally be fully alive in your true self. Wow. Okay, the mermaid immersion speaks. It has come time to completely involve yourself. You have been holding back, only going so far with a new project or with a commitment to yourself, always pulling back at the last moment from taking the step. You are holding the part of yourself back, watching, judging, always assessing whether this is right or wrong. You are surrounding yourself with what you consider to be protection and what humans call buffer zones. And you claim you want change. You claim you wish to understand. You claim you wish to have this done. If this is true, then the time has come to take a deep breath, dive off the edge of the cliff, and emerge yourself fully in the waters of change. Go underneath to the truth of what has happened and surround yourself only with what supports that change. The time has come to remove the buffer zones and to have enough faith in your friendship and family relations to know that if they are meant to be, they will be there when you return. You need not take the plunge. It is not compulsory, sorry, but it is what you have claimed you wanted. Come with me. I will teach you how to breathe on the water and then finally the truth you have claimed you have been reaching for will be yours. Wow. Okay, there's a change. Oh, you just got lightheaded. Oof. Okay. Now, let's see what we got. What message do we have for our Libras from their angel guides? Send the masters their love, crossover loved ones. What messages do we have for Libra, please? What's the message here? Three of Earth. Okay, teamwork. Working together. There's something that's coming up that you're going to be able to work together with someone. Build something here. Crossing you, we have the Seven of Air. So it's like the Seven of Swords. There's communication coming in. There's there. I think you're going to be talking to a lot of different people. You might be um, talking to people from all around the world or just um, multicultural people. I feel like a, a diverse group of people that you're talking to, whatever you're doing, if it's a new job or at work. This is something to do with work because we have three Earth. So I think whatever you do for work, if there's more people that are you're going to be talking to than you did in the past. 
just this balanced Libra, your energy. So everything's balancing out for you. Things are becoming just. So if something was not right before, it's going to be right now. Ace of Earth. In the recent past, something, you might have a new opportunity that came in. Maybe a new job offer. Um, maybe that's what this is all about here, that you, you're in a new job and you're working very well. It's a nice teamwork environment and you meet many different people from many different backgrounds. And we have five of here. Okay, this is, um, I feel like you're trying to dance around an issue with somebody. There's something going on here that you're not, you're trying not to, um, go directly to the point on something. You're trying to get around a, a situation or an issue. It's, it's, you have to be very delicate with this matter. <clears throat> Seven of Earth. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> Someone wants to speak to you. <clears throat> so seven earth here. Okay, so here you're trying to um you're you're recognizing things you didn't see before. There's something in your environment, might be at your work, that is coming into your vision that you weren't able to see before. <clears throat> now whatever you're doing here is bringing things to light, is bringing things out in the open that were hidden. <clears throat> Oh, someone must speak the magician okay we have the magician here so you are manifesting like crazy so whatever you want you're able to manifest so keep your thoughts positive because whatever you think about is what you're going to bring about and you are the emperor wow people see you as someone in, in charge powerful uh, you could be in a very powerful position you could have just got promoted to this position too but someone sees you as having the capabilities and able to conquer whatever you need to conquer that you are very balanced and just and righteous i'm getting a very righteous feeling here and you might even be um royalty are you of um yeah, you might even be like in the royal family or a royalty. There's something of you very noble and royal here <clears throat> in this energy. <clears throat> Someone wants to speak, boy. <clears throat> and there and you're putting a lot of time in work. A lot of focus on your work. You might have many projects you're doing, but you're doing very well with them. And we have the moon. Pisces, um, Scorpio or Cancer energy. A lot of emotions here, but something is hidden. In the bottom here we have King of War. So this is um, Scorpio, Cancer, and Pisces again. There's a lot of emotions coming towards you. Someone has a lot of emotions for you. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> Someone definitely wants to speak to you. Get a sip of water. See if I can clear this a little bit. <clears throat> I'm getting too scratchy. <clears throat> okay, I'm sorry. I hate to do that, but <clears throat> I'm, it's very annoying to feel that scratchiness. Okay. Three of Earth. Why is it three of Earth here? Three of Earth again. So three of Pentacles. Yes. You have a very nice environment. You are working very well with others. I think if you are in a leadership role, people respect you. And they um, they look up to you. They follow you. And they see, they appreciate your work. They understand how you work. And um, I also feel for some, if you are in a new position, the person that was in there before, this the people in that um, that were under this person did not like them, respect them like they do you. You're getting a lot more respect. <clears throat> okay, seven it here. The hermit. Okay, you might be um, going off to your, to be alone for a little bit, trying to figure things out. There is a lot of things coming in at you. I feel like you're you're getting a lot of signs, a lot of information. So you might need to take a little pause now and then. Go deep within and reflect. You are the teacher. You are the student. You are learning a lot at this time, but you are also teaching others. You are going within to, to learn things so that you can be a beacon for others. So you can teach others. There's so much that you are learning. It feels like you're, I feel like your mind is going at warp speed here. That there's so much information coming towards you. And it's like, it's, it's blowing your mind how fast this information is coming in. But it's something that's needed because you are there to be the light to lead the way for others. <clears throat> you are their guide. Okay, now justice. Ten of 
temperance yes you are balancing things out sagittarius energy things are just seem to be working now things might not have worked in the past but now things are coming together i feel a very energy of being very balanced very secure knowing and feeling just so good that you haven't felt this way in a long time but now you feel like things are finally working you whatever you touch is like you have the midas touch okay now the ace of earth here why do we have the ace of earth here Ooh, the page of pentacles yes someone came in with an offer in the recent past towards you it could be an um here we have earth so Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn doesn't have to be, but there was an offer that was made in the recent past, and it was a good offer here. It, it brought in prosperity for you. Very nice. Could have been an offer for love, could have been an offer for business, but it is um, abundance. Bringing in abundance. Okay, what about the five of the year? Mm, seven of cups wow yeah there's confusion here there's something about i feel still feel like you're dancing around an issue or you're trying to figure out how to talk to someone maybe that's i'm probably getting your energy trying to clear my throat trying to figure out how to say something um but this this is coming across that you're you're going to figure it out you're the right words are going to come in and you're going to make you need to have choices you have different way of approaching um almost feels like there's many different situations coming towards you and you have many different ways of solving the problems and that's why you'll go deep within reflect and figure out which way to go about things okay and, but you are getting shown things that you weren't being shown before what about this seven of earth five of pentacles someone feels left out abandoned by you that they're they're lost it could be that your energy feels that way from maybe a situation you had to leave to go into a new job that you felt that you just weren't getting um the recognition you deserved but someone also could be feeling that you're not seeing them you're not recognizing them you're there's yeah, someone feels like they're not getting noticed okay the magician why do we have the magician here Five of Wands, competition. Yeah, you are very pa uh, powerful, and people are seeing your power. They're seeing how you're able to manifest, and there, I feel jealousy here. I feel a jealousy of your situation. Of maybe you did get a raise or a promotion, and people are jealous. There's a lot of bickering and and around you, but you are the right choice for this um, position. Okay, what's the emperor here? Why is the emperor here? The fool, new beginning. Yes, this is all new. This is starting something new here. I th really think that a lot of you got a um, promotion or got a new job that is really where you're supposed to be. It feels like this is exactly where you're supposed to be. Taking the leap of faith of coming into this power because you can do it. Hey, the earth. Why is the earth? A lot of work here. yes see you have the strength leo you have the strength to do whatever you have to do whatever this takes whatever kind if you have a lot of different projects you got to take care of you have the strength to get through it you have the endurance you're gonna make it no question about it what about the moon okay yes you're moving away from something to something better there was something that was hidden here that was not working for you and there's too many emotions that were not stable so you're moving on from that to something better you're moving on probably to this king of water here and there also could be a commitment here marriage engagement also could be a business but things look really good look really stable for you guys things are changing things are shifting they look really good okay so now let me my cards here What else do we have for Libra? Lighten your load. Yes, if you are in charge now, if you are um, have a promotion, delegate some of your um, tasks that you have to do, responsibility to others. Lighten your load. If there's too much that you're taking on, lighten it because you are working very hard here. Peace. You're going to come into peace. You're going to feel this um, justice and temperance is bringing you peace. 
things are shifting and changing. You're moving away from all this conflict. Travel, and you're going to be traveling. I also, you know, this travel, and this could be travel here, and you know, these are both are like on the same order that you're traveling. You're going somewhere. You might have to travel. Business might travel um, for love, maybe even. You might, maybe your your person that you love is at a distance. But love is also coming in for you. There's, this seems really nice. I'm really liking this. Okay, now we'll end your reading with a blessed bee. And please give me a thumbs up if you like these readings so I know if you want me to do them again. But let's see. What is a blessed bee? A blessing for the right words. Wow, who did Aquarius just have that? Okay. Okay. A blessing for apt speech to call to your lips the right words that speak simply and clearly and find their mark. May the words that fall from your lips be blessed, friend. In times when we must speak of difficult things, it can be a great challenge to conjure up the words that best express our feelings and intent without causing offense or harm to another. We struggle sometimes with the balance and in doing so our words may be watered down, lost in the desire to appease, in a wish to do no harm. But with this blessing there will be words that come to find you without effort, the words of light by the fires of inspiration and they will flow from your mind to your mouth and be heard fully and fairly. May you be blessed this day with the speech of good sense, the conversation that clears and clarifies, and must, most of all, the words that will be heard by those who need to understand and to listen. May you be blessed with the words that stir hearts that, admit, that make friends of minds and once more firm against yours. May your words like water seep their way into the cracks of the stone and work their magic of transformation within. Your words are spells and their magic can take time. But with the apt speech that you are blessed with this day, doors of understanding open up between you and others. And where you once fell silent, you will speak up. Where you once faltered and shied away from the difficult things that must be said, you will be you will rise and flow through this challenge and embrace the opportunity to give voice to the darkness. Where once you let others speak and heard only your own words in your mind, you will now hear them out in the world and know you have used words as others use weapons, but it is not for battle, rather for courage and understanding. May you find ways to cut through the falsehoods that others and their words can weave upon you. Let your words be songs of praise as they flow from the gift of speech you have been blessed with. May you no longer stay quiet, friend, for you have been blessed with the power of right speech and it will serve you well each time you sing out your truth. Blessed be. Okay, Libra, thank you so much for viewing this um, video. I hope to see you again real soon.